What's up, y'all? Lather Attic here with another relaxing shave video. This one's gonna be silly, fun, but hey, sometimes you gotta let loose. Six Solo, I don't know, uh, I have mentioned his channel before. We're kind of coming up same time, tagging me in a video. Uh, best face painting brush video. Sid, I accept your challenge, brother. Here's my take on it. I'm going to tag three other YouTubers, uh, challenging them to do the same thing. So, uh, Sig's video was great. I'm going to put a link to it down below in the description. Check it out. Great video. Great guy. Fun guy. I think it's funny. I think it's, it's great. Sometimes you just got to let loose. And I mean, look, I told y'all, South Alabama dress shirt right here, man. Fat man in a little coat, you know. I'm doing the Chris Farley, so <laughs> I think it's better. It's not going to be all over my collar. So, hey, let's have fun, man, right? So, the purpose of the tag of the video was to take an actual painting brush and use it to lather. Now, in Sig's video, he had, you know, the classic, you know, three or four inch painter's brush, you know, the flat one. I think his was natural hair. Mine is a synthetic, but when I told my wife about it, that, you know, I was tagged in a video, what I have to do, she's an awesome person, man. She was like, I got the perfect brush for you. And we ran to the um, Home Depot and she picked it out. And this is it right here. Now, I have not opened it up. It is a zebra round it's a one inch round brush it's used to paint banisters and stuff and she said doesn't this look like in one of your shade brushes and i was like damn look at that how cool is that man i've not opened it up yet or anything but this is it right here and the rules let me go over the rules real quick the rules sig said you uh I got it written down, so full disclosure. You have to use an actual painting brush made for painting. Boom. Uh, you cannot try it beforehand. You have to do it on camera, first time use in the vid. Boom. And you have two weeks to uh, respond and do your own vid, and then you can tag three other people. So, boom. I think uh, it's last week, last Friday. So I'm at eight days. Got it in time. Boom, right there. The zebra, synthetic hair. Let's open it up. Take a look at this thing. When I saw this, I was like, you are an amazing woman. Thank you, baby. Wow. Right there. Get it out. Whoop, it's stuck. Hang on. There we go. <laughs> right there and I was like you know I told her I was like shit I could probably use this to you know to lather up with all the time and then oh wow wow that is stiff wow <laughs> wow it's got a good backbone that's it right there synthetic hairs you know metal wood handle zebra Right there, go to pick that up, zebra. How cool is that, man? So, there you go, Sig. Yeah. Okay. Now, to soak or not to soak, that is the question. I don't have anything else ready, so I'm going to bowl lather with it. I thought about that. I thought about, hmm, should I use the Cremo and try to, but wow, dude, that is like super stiff. Look at that. Oh, man. So, we're going to bowl lather. <sighs> okay. While I get the soap ready, all I did, put water in there, put the brush in there. Kind of, <laughs> I don't know. Okay. 
I ought to just soak it in the sink actually. But let's talk about what else we're gonna use. But zebra, that the back right there. It is an actual painting brush. Uses spindles, corbels, railings, furniture, frames, and more. Zebra. Hey, at least let's uh, lather in luxury, huh? Cavendish, PAA, tobacco. Wow. I got this sample and I haven't used it yet. So that's what we're going to use. And we're going to use the Rockwell 6S Gray Razor. Setting 5, or should I say plate 5, right there. You can see that. Get my big finger out the way. Plate 5. And in there, we're going to load up a uh, Gillette Ruby. Bam. So, blade. Let's load the razor up. Because I have no idea what's going to happen when I go to start lathering. <laughs> Let's see, huh? Let's see. I know it's been a minute since my last video, guys. I appreciate you watching. To my new friends of the channel, welcome. And to returning friends, good to see you again. And I want to say, if I can get, I noticed that I have a couple of more subscribers, friends of the channel. If I can get to 100, I want to do, I have a special giveaway that's planned. So let's make it happen. If you got friends of yours who, you know, like to be entertained and have fun and laugh and watch a dude talk to his, you know, himself, <laughs> send them over here, man. We will welcome them with open arms. It's a crazy train. All right, the ruby is in. There, plate five. Okay, that's the that's the wrapper, wax wrapper. It doesn't have the you know double wrapped. Okay, Cavendish. Wow, tobacco. Mm. Oh, got it on my nose again. Like tobacco, floral, like flower. Good stuff. Okay, it's been soaking long enough. Shake it. I'm just gonna set it right back in the sink. It's probably a bad idea. Uh, yeah, that's fine. Okay. Scoop some out. Uh, let's say that much. Probably too much, but hey, who knows? It may not be enough. I may have to load s some more in there. See how it goes. I'm going to put just a little more in there. Because I am kind of nervous and kind of excited <laughs> at the same time. So, okay. There we go. And you know what I do. Just smush it down in the bottom. Makes it easier. Doesn't have to be pretty. Man, it's not meant to be pretty. Cavendish. Wow. Good smelling stuff. Okay. PAA stuff's good. You know, slick. Great stuff. Okay, we put just a tad bit of water in here, hopefully from the brush. Oh yeah, shake that out. Hmm. Here we go, lather away. <laughs> uh. Now Sig's video, he bowled. He bowled lather, but he had that big brush. So I'm kind of hoping, because I saw his and I was like, hmm, maybe I can find a smaller one. And like I said, my wife, as soon as I told her about it, she was like, I got the perfect brush for you. But I can tell you, it's as stiff as a board. Look at that. Ding, 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 ding. <laughs> working up some, but it is stiff. Wow. 
I'm gonna get some pumping action going. Tell you what, if you like a brush with some backbone, buddy, this is the brush for you. Kind of reminds me of one of those vintage, um, shoot, what do they call them? The Camons? Simon? You know what I'm talking about. You know, the vintage brushes with the long, you know, the double ducks and stuff, the big long handles. This is what it reminds me of. The problem is getting all the soap to, there we go, to work up in a lather. I can't believe I'm going to say this, but I think it needs more water. Let's get just a tad. That may be a mistake. Nah. Wow. Okay. <laughs> uh, now I see why he wanted uh, you to not try it first. <laughs> just do it on camera, huh? Apologize for the clanking. It drives me nuts too, y'all. Wow. Once I get it going. Okay, there we go. Okay. On the side, I need to get it like that and push it against the side like that. You can see that, just like that. That's what I'm doing. I think this is the longest I've ever lathered. Yeah, it is. Okay, if y'all are still watching, there you go. Look at that sheen. That is beautiful yogurt right there. Okay. Wow, that was a workout. All right, glasses off. Pow. I'm blind as a bat. All right, let's wet the face. I haven't shaved since Wednesday. Oh, and I forgot to mention, this is like a kind of a coldish, lukewarm kind of shave. Not wet. Oh, not wet. <laughs> not hot. Which of course I don't. I don't shave really, really hot. It's like warm. You know, hot water is bad for your skin, man. You heard it here first. Okay, here we go. Best face painting brush. Mmm, man. The scent on the soap's amazing. No joke. But if y'all can hear, man, that is stiff. Wow, that is stiff. <laughs> uh, it's definitely a different experience, I'll tell you that. Wow. This may be good for all you synthetic guys. I don't know. <laughs> okay. Whew. There you go. Hmm. Hey. <sighs> Let's give it a go, huh? Nice, uh, I haven't bowl lathered in a minute, too, so, that was, uh, that was definitely, uh, getting back on the bike. Here we go. First pass, Ruby, Rockwell, plate five. Wow, you hear that? Wow, nice feedback. I love this razor, man. Shave ain't about the razor, it's about the brush, but man, this razor is awesome. Wow, that, man. 
it's just that feel. I heard some people commenting about the 6C and the 6S, one's chrome, one stainless, you know, the difference of glides. Dude, I don't know, man. Honestly, sometimes I think it's just all in your mind. But, you know. Maybe that's just how it is for some people. Like I said, you know, stainless steel blades are just in my face. That could be all in my mind. Honestly. So, who am I to say? I don't know. I don't think there's ruby stainless steel. Could be wrong. <sighs> Look at that. <laughs> First pass wiped out on that five. Wow. Okay. Hmm. It's funny. Spend more time lathering than you do shaving. Isn't that how it goes? But that's the part you really enjoy, ain't it? When you have a smooth like butter shave and a good lather, it's the part I enjoy. The lathering process. The shave is smooth like butter. Killer, man. Those are the best ones. Okay, second pass. The ones where you don't have to struggle with the shave and it don't tug, it don't pull. I mean, you know, a minute and you're done shaving. Those are the best ones to me. Because really, the relaxing part is this right here, in my opinion. This is what makes it, you know, enjoyable. This part right here. like Bob Ross. Okay. We're going to put just a happy little ladder right there. Man, that's where he lives. Right there. Yeah. <laughs> Y'all ever watch Bob Ross, man? He was probably one of the most honest and genuine dudes. Seemed like anyways. Wow, I can't believe this brush, man. Killer. Look at that. Whipped it up. That may be the soap too, but wow. Killer, man. Fantastic. All right. Hmm. Outstanding. Second pass with the grain. I gotta say, man, digging the uh, digging the tank, man. My wife was like, "Why are you getting those?" <laughs> if I told you, you wouldn't believe me. <laughs> but hey, girl came through on the brush. Okay, here we go. This is against the grain. Fantastic. Wow. For all you guys struggling to get your lather right, that's what you want, man. See it? I would just, and when you go to rinse, it should just rinse off. That's when you know it's well hydrated. If you're struggling to get it off your razor, man, don't have enough water in it. Don't be scared to add water, man. Don't, because I mean, that's the key to everything. Good hydration. It's gotta be well hydrated, or else, you know, the razor is not gonna glide. You're not going to be using it to its full potential at all. All right, let's go back. Yeah, and then we'll go forward. You 
your ladder will tell you what it needs. If it ain't rinsing off your razor right, it's not hydrated enough, man. You need more, more water, more aqua. Wow. Right, let's go back and we'll go forward. I always struggle with that. Everybody has their struggles. You know, because, man, my hair doesn't grow normal. I guess I ain't a normal dude. <laughs> it doesn't grow. It grows whoop, 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 up. It's a bunch of whoops in it up. So for me to get BBS, I got to at least make three passes. At least. And depending on the razor and the blade, sometimes three and a touch up. Because my hair, man, just grows weird. See, I need to go up to get... I mean, I can hear that. Now, this is good because it grows this way. And this is good because I went against going down because it grows up. So... And that's enough of my life story. One more pass. Look at that yogurt, man. I mean, it almost looks like Elmer's glued. Does it not? Wow. That is some well-hydrated shit, as they would say. I'm just gonna glob it on. I just gotta get that against and maybe some touch ups because it feels so good. I think just that little bit of extra water I added, man, did it. Mm hmm. Wow. Just set that there because I wanna see how much <laughs> soap is in that brush when we're done. Okay. Just a touch up pass. Get where I can see. Now the one thing I will tell you, I use this Ruby shaving off camera. Yeah, I know I do. This is sin, I'm sorry. With my uh uh, with my 69 Black Beauty, did not like it. It hated that blade. It, it hated this blade. It did not like it at all, man. Horrible shave. So, I do believe, I'm a firm believer that certain razors like certain blades. Because I have experienced it with my own eyes. And skin. It doesn't mean that you have to just use that blade, unless that's the razor you have. You know. But I have experienced that for myself. All right. Now backwards here because it grows that way. Weird. And we'll go down at an angle. Just to get this across right here. And then we're gonna bullfrog it. Mm-hmm. Wow. Line up the goatee. Just because it feels good. Okay. You must drain the sink because it's got a lot of hair in there. And let's uh let's have a feel. Wow. Man. Cold here today. Mm, for us sucks man we go from like 80 degrees to like 40 in the morning all right apologies 
rinsing out the sink. Rinsing out the sink, rinsing out the sink. Whoa. There's a chunk of soap that didn't get lathered up. <laughs> Alright, here we go. Get all that soap off, man. Let's see how much is left in this brush, huh? <laughs> Let's get it all out of there. There's the bowl. Empty. Not bad. There's the brush. Didn't lose a hair. First world problems, right? Look at that. That is good stuff right there, man. And tobacco y scent, flowery. Okay, let's rinse that off. Enough playing around. Let me rinse the brush out real quick so I can show y'all it again. <laughs> Did a lot better than I thought it would do. Felt scritchy on the face. It out. There it is, the zebra. Round, one inch round. Right there. Alright, that's enough of that. Let's get the cold water going. Shaking out the brush. <laughs> Dummy. Whew. Okay. Alright. Wow. Good shave. Rockwell. Never let you down. Never going to give you up. Never going to let you down. Alright. Let's go. Thayer's. Not a lot. Just a little. Just a toner. Good stuff. And you know, whoop, sorry about the shakiness. Lubriderm. Just a squirt. Oh yeah. Good stuff. Get it all around. Your skin is your friend. Wow. And finally, dry my hands. The goods. The goods. Now all I have is samples. But when this sample runs out, I am going to order some more of this Cavendish. That's the sample vial right there. Careful. Don't spill this good stuff. Ooh, that was close. It's got this little, I don't know what that is, but it's down inside it. No reducer, so you got to put your finger over because it'll just come out. There's enough in here for probably two. I would say two good splashes. So stop her back in. Wow. Oh yeah. This stuff always has alcohol in it, man. It's good stuff. Douglas Smythe stuff always has alcohol in it. It's like after shake cologne. Shade, man. Amazing. Okay. We survived. 
It can be done. I want to see who can top that right there. <laughs> Who's going to get one better than that, huh? Let's see. This is as close that I've seen to an actual shaving brush right here. Who's going to top that? The zebra. One inch round. I want to see it. So, glasses back on. I tag Matthew and Matthew Lawrence. Great shave channel. Great guy. Spoken with him a few times. Great guy. Matt, I tag you. Rusty at the Rusty Razor. Rusty, great guy. Always, always willing to conversate. Rusty, I tag you, brother. And finally, Drew at Whisker Assassin, I tag you. Let's see them. The rules are an actual paintbrush. You cannot try the brush before the video. You have two weeks to film and upload. So, Sig, there you go. I hope it was up to where yours was, brother. It's fun. I love it. I love having fun. I love being silly, man. You know, sometimes it's cool just to let loose and have fun. So, I had a blast. I hope y'all had a blast. I want to say thanks for watching. Thanks for sticking through the whole thing. And if you're still here and you haven't subscribed, hit that button, man. This is a crazy train. You know it. We riding. Choo choo. So, to all the friends of the channel, thank you. Without y'all, I wouldn't be filming these videos. I appreciate each and every one of you, all your comments. I answer them. I love it, man. I love, you know, conversing with people. It's great. To all the new subscribers, leave a comment. Say, hey, new sub, you know? Dude, let's get the conversation going, brother. And like I said, if I can get to 100, I have a special giveaway that's planned. So, I never thought I'd make it to where I am. Very humbled, very appreciative. I love it. This is Lather Attic saying, not every day begins with a shave, but maybe a shave can brighten your day. Until next time, stay safe, y'all. See you again.